All right, going to hop into another swing check here for my buddy Alex. This is Ryan from Golf Fit. First things first, let's take a look here. You can see right away there is a huge difference in the posture from his first swing, which is up on top. He sent this to me about three months ago versus the swing on the bottom. You can see you've got a lot more space now from the hands to the body, which is great. Your hands are still hanging naturally from the shoulder socket, which is great. Um, overall, just significantly better. You're not as congested there on your uh, address position. So as we take the club away and take a look at the, the backswing here a little bit, pretty similar backswing so far. As we get up to the top of the golf swing, Still pretty pretty sim similar, but notice the difference in your knee bend and your hip position because of your knee bend. Way, way better, like way more athletic. Um, and so that's going to help you maintain your posture a little better in the downswing. As we start your transition, you're now able to look at the difference of the shaft angle here, right? So now you're actually shallowing out that club a little bit versus here you were staying very vertical with that shaft angle. Um, and so that's going to allow you to get more of the body engaged in this swing. You can see you are attacking the golf ball from the inside, which is great versus here. You were like right on the edge of that inside position, but you were cutting across the ball there on the follow on the hitting zone. And so that was more of an outside to in swing, whereas this one is more inside to out. And you can see that show up in your body posture here uh, on your follow through, right? And so now you're gonna be able to release that club. You can see the exit point is just over that left shoulder, which is tour average. You also had a left shoulder tour uh, club exit there, um, but it just was a little bit more congested than where we are now. Um, as far as uh, continued improvement, I want to say, first of all, congratulations. That's significantly better than where you started. So great work. The one thing I would change is see how the club comes, comes underneath the primary swing plane line there. Then it comes down. You are getting the club on plane, but that's technically a modified over the top golf swing because the club path goes lower first and then even though it's shallowing out, it's still above where you originally took the club away, right? And that's all in the rotation of this back shoulder. So you can see how that shoulder goes back and then it comes down, right? What you want, if, if you can, is you want to reverse the rotation of the shoulder. So get the club going more out first, then loop the club back underneath and that's going to work with that natural internal rotation of the shoulder. So if you need more help with that, let me know. I hope that helps. As always, aim small, swing smooth, peace.